Myanmar Tourism Federation and Han State Foundations on Tuesday held a conference on the participation of women in the booming tourism industry. Attendees say they see white gender discrimination, especially on work opportunities, but all are optimistic that in combined force, women empowerment is no impossible mission. Sharon Wynn has the story. Promoting women's economic empowerment and improving entrepreneurship opportunities for women, especially to participate in the tourism sectors, is the aim of this conference. In world tourism, women are concentrated in the lowest paid, lowest skilled, and are not well represented in the highest levels of employment and management, according to Hans Seidel Foundation. While there are no available hard facts yet in Myanmar on this regard, industry players see a wide gap between working men and women in the tourism sector. I think uh, it's important because there's a lot of inequality. And so it needs to, we need to raise awareness about these inequalities in the tourism sector. We are, um, especially in, in terms of women employment, where there's a lot of inequalities. Industry experts believe that the impact of the greater gender equality and women's empowerment would highly benefit for the communities and the country in general. And never look down on a girl saying that a girl cannot do. So if we stop saying that, if we stop thinking that with this invisible culture uh, barriers, girls will come more out front age. Opportunities are vast and experts say boosting women participation in decision making, management and even in jobs that may seem only men can do would tap the highest potential of the industry. I think for me tourism is really a tool yeah, to achieve equality in, in, in gender issues and uh, it's, it's, it's about um, that, that women have the same opportunities in their professional life than men have. About 40 participants attended during this conference. Sharon MITV, Memorial International Television.